What's up guys, Johnny Gaming here today, and welcome back to more Atomic Heart. So the last time we were here, we got our abilities where we can scan by putting our L fingers up. So that's cool. Um, we went inside these abilities to scan two lovely robots. Um, made them... I was being a bit of dumb because it was the only reason why I couldn't get in part because the game hasn't finished its song. Me being a big dummy and you can Anywho, um, make sure you hit that subscribe button and notify the case button so you can notify when I post. Please secure your seatbelt. We wish you a very pleasant journey. Isn't there supposed to be a radio in here? Wait, what? The entire Soviet Union is ecstatic about the unveiling of Collective 2.0 with yeah, parades I just came from in every city. It. The American government is expressing deepening concern about the skyrocketing unemployment wow. figures following the deliveries of Politics robotic workers from that. the Soviet We've got plenty of thought devices. There won't be a shortage, said People's this Deputy Alexander Shalchinov in response to widespread concern in the city of Ozyorsk. How about some music? That's more like it. I see you finally begun your assignment, Wait, and it's been less than an hour. They are good. Jawohl, mein Fjord. What did Wait. you just say? I said the signal's on the fritz, but thanks anyway, Herr Stockhausen. Dr. Sechenov already filled me in. Don't you think that may have been a bit too much? Nope. For some reason, your response didn't surprise Whoa. me at all. Guess I don't have any respect for brown nosers. Tell me, is there anyone you do have respect for? Sure, but respect is earned. Dr. Sechenov has mine because he saved my life on the operating table. Everybody else needs to earn it. Anyway, why the hell are we riding a jalopy strapped to a damn robot? Were all the jets taken or something? <laughs> Shit. Riding turbines is an important tradition. It's a way to remember the days when Facility 3826 was brand new, as we used to ride these vehicles to our very first scientific complex. Fair enough, but why is it a tradition to have them pulled by bumblebees? And why do we call them bumblebees when they look more like flying pigs? Flying pigs? Have you seen flying pigs before? How about flying cows? Yeah, on the Condor. One time some genius like you forgot to put up a fence, but those cows only flew in one direction, straight down. I have a suggestion, Comrade Major. Why don't you worry about your mission, and I'll do the thinking for both of us? Shut the hell up, Glove. I'm trying to listen. To what? Is there anything here you haven't seen yet? I've never been here before. Zip it. What? How come? I don't know, damn it. Now quit bugging me. My apologies. Oh, that is scary. It's not that car flying. Straight back there. But yo, why is everything in here? That's my This is a okay. This is 100%. Bioshock. No question. Hags. 100% Bioshock. Listen, if you drop me, it's gonna be in here. Oh. Oh, Alright, on the top of the world, I'm going to go back to 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 the world, I
This is facility 3826's audio guide. We will soon be arriving at our destination. Estimated time of arrival is 11.47 a.m. Outside temperature, 26 degrees Celsius. There is a slight breeze. You can now observe the Soyuz Granite Bridge spanning Lake Lazur and two of the facility's high-profile test sites, the VDNH and Sahalin. These are connected by magnetic levitation or maglev rail. This technology was pioneered by the Chelame Design Department and a personal project of Dr. Lebedyansky. You can now observe the operations of an automated plant performing robot assembly and distributing machine parts required by the facility's various complexes. Controlled remotely by a collective 1.0 node, a plant such as this is capable of autonomously managing and fulfilling up to 100 orders per hour. Directly below is Dr. Sechenov's computational center, the main radio processing unit and control nexus for this network node. We are currently flying over Sunflower Solar Farms, capable of supplying electricity to the entire VDNH, as well as the Friendship of People's Park, nearby settlements, and the Maglev train lines. Maglev train stations connect all of Facility 3826, allowing personnel to travel from one complex to another with comfort and ease. We are now flying past the majestic Call of the Motherland Monument, erected in 1949 to mark the Soviet Union's victory in World War II, and are now entering the grounds of the Vavilov Complex, the site where Facility 3826's numerous agricultural miracles took root. You are now observing the Soviet Sickle Monument, designed by sculptors Elena Mukhina and Alexander Kibalnikov, and autonomously erected in 1951 by the Collective 1.0 Neural Network with the help of robot builders. Note that this effectively makes it the world's first collaborative artistic effort between man and machine. Our brief guided tour is coming to an end. Facility 3826 is always ready to welcome new specialists from anywhere in the Soviet Union. We are confident that you will be thrilled to live and work in this world of revolutionary breakthroughs and fantastic scientific achievements for the glory of the Communist Party and the Soviet people. Why, why is this car shaking, Roma? Major, Petrova's initiating combat maneuvers. Initiating what? For real? Watch out! Now. What am I supposed to do about For it? Your safety, what the? Please do not unfasten your seatbelt until the vehicle has come to a complete stop. Oh, okay. You have reached your destination. You are now at the laboratory gate. Oh, snap. Have a nice day. Take my hand, Comrade Major. I will escort you to the Vavilov Complex. What in the sweaty hell is going on here? Unfortunately, I have no information on the oh, subject. Yes. All the robots have been carrying out their normal operations until they suddenly became hostile. Oh, what the hell I are you slipped. doing, you lousy bot? Get your rusty metal asses out of here! That was really very rude of them. The elevator is now operational. Oh, snap. Well, I, I called it. Fuck off, bitch! <laughs> Just wanna be broken. Our ascent is once again continuing normally. A Drofa towing robot will be here shortly to perform magnetic coupling and take us by air to... No. Nope. Son of a bitch, not again. This... Oh, this help me, Comrade Major. I'm falling. What the shit? Atomic Heart. Okay. Uh, well, our robots just started. Um, robots are to take conquering the world. 
And uh, yeah. <laughs> Woohoo! Let's do this. Attention. This is an amazing Just shock him. There you go. Do one more. One more shot. Oh, he's breathing. You're alright. You look. Ooh, look at him. I'm handsome. Look at him. He's handsome. Look at that handsome man. My bed. I bet you that everything is taking over. I mean, everything got me here. Oh, shit, my head's killing me. Ugh. Wow. Yeah, there's no way a lot of this. There's no point. Wizard, this is P3. Come in. Sergey, are you alright, my boy? I'm okay, boss. But nothing here is the way it's supposed to be. Whatever's going on clearly started a while ago. Victor Petrov <gasps> is the reason. He's a traitor who hacked into Collective Central Hub and caused the civilian robots to attack facility employees. Petrov has the access codes for the hub. Your mission is to find him and bring him to me alive. Copy that, sir. The target is Viktor Petrov. My mission is to find him and bring him to you. Exactly. Okay. Section of out. Swum through polymer plenty of times and I haven't drowned yet. It's a frickin' miracle of modern science. Really? Oh my gosh, this is polymer? Wow. Hey, I got scared. I thought I got stuck. Oh, 
Holy shit. Hey, Glove. Oh, yes, Major. Any details on the target? Victor Petrov is the lead engineer behind Collective 2.0. He was arrested for treason and sentenced to community service at the Vavilov complex. Got it. I can deal with that. Where should I start looking? Petrov is currently somewhere in the underground levels of the Vavilov complex. We'll have to find a way inside. Okay, let's do it. Hey, you! I'm coming! You alive in there? Somebody help me! I'm gonna die in here! I swear you attack me, I'm Shit! Uh, get away from me! Looking at, almost choked to death there. Give me a hand. Oh, I didn't see that coming. Mm. Oh. You should be more careful. This place is a damn madhouse. Yeah, I noticed. Uh -huh. Thanks for the help, no ma'am. No sweat, Sonny. <sighs> what are you doing here, anyway? Oh, just passing through. Who are you? Me, Zena, Granny Zena. That's all you need to know. Fine, I get it. So what's going on here? Lots of casualties. I don't know if you noticed, but the robots are attacking people. Anyone who couldn't find a place to hide is... dead meat. I could really use a weapon. You got anything? I think you lose of your course. Ass. But I'm not giving you shit. Beneath us is a complex. If you need a weapon, go down there. The Vavilov complex? That's where I'm headed. Ah. Oh. Well, today's your lucky day. I'm heading that way, too. It's basically safe. Shit! It's a chilla! Son of a bitch! We've got 30 seconds! Move your ass! 30 seconds until what? Uh, 30 seconds until we're fucked, sonny boy! Royally fucked! Oh. No good! Get over here, beefcake! Now, no, 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 now! Take this key and turn it clockwise! I said clockwise, idiot. Yeah, like that. I'll hold them off for now. Wait, what? You got a hell of an arsenal there, lady. What are you planning? Here we go. You've been riding my ass for two days now. Take that. Eat shit and die. Where'd you get that thing? No Give it to way. me! way! You hang on to that key. I got this. Uh. Oh, oh, oh my god. Holy shit! Goddamn clusterfuck. Why am I crouched?
We need to find a way to open this armored door. Gee, you think? Enough with the lame advice, will ya? Why don't you tell me more about Petrov? How'd they track him down anyway? Petrov's betrayal was discovered by Mikhail Stockhausen. He was then arrested by the Argentum unit. So how'd he end up here? After the trial, Petrov was sentenced to community service and sent back here as a prisoner. What, they couldn't find anyone else in the whole Soviet Union to do his job? Collective's launch was only a few months away. Replacing the lead engineer would have been foolish. Petrov had to finish what he'd started, and that's what they made him do. What's so special about the guy? Viktor Petrov was previously the lead engineer of a secret department within the Academy of Consequences, dedicated to programming robots for Collective 2.0. Right. some advice. I'm kind of busy right now. Bye-bye.